Good morning guys, here's a follow-up to my flanking uh, transmitter setup video that I just did. Um, this chart here shows the directions of uh, thrust and the rudder control and the, the direction I'm trying to move the uh, barge and you might want to pause it to look at that if, you, if you're interested. And then here's the demonstration actually um, flanking the barge. Um, it's uh, a lot more rudder input than anything else. I'm basically just running the right stick in a pivoting maneuver and then I only go forward or reverse just enough to keep the barge from moving forward or backwards because when I'm trying to flank I'm usually trying to go exactly uh, parallel to the shore left and right like you see there and so I'm just going to bump it forward or backward just a tiny bit and it's easy to introduce a little bit of that motion that you don't really want so that's that's all I'm doing there otherwise it's strictly a pivoting maneuver with the right stick so just uh, to the right or to the left and then the rudder is actually what's uh, causing it to, to flank because you'll see here when I do a straight pivot which I'm just pushing the stick to the right so one prop's moving a thrusting forward, the other is exactly the same direction or same thrust but opposite, and it pivots the barge around roughly at the where the props are at at the back end of the boat. So then to stop it from pivoting, you just use the opposite rudder, and that's what kind of I tried to show in the diagram. That causes the boat to flank uh, whichever way. So you're gonna you're gonna push like to the right with the right stick. It's going to try to pivot the front end to the right. Then you'll push the rudder the opposite way and then that causes the, the one prop that's thrusting forward gets the, the flow of water across that prop or that rudder and then that causes the back end of the bar or tow boat to move the same direction. So that's uh, what makes it work. Thanks for watching.